backstory. So I have my friend at my door and he calls me on phone and he says, yo dude, where are you? And I say, I'm out. And he says, I need to get my stuff from you, please, real quick. So I turn and say, just hold up, drop the call. I'll send you the, the key by SMS. And he was like, what kind of keys do you want to send by SMS? I'm sure you're wondering the same thing. I'm about to show you how you can send your door keys by SMS. Let's roll. So today we'll be looking at something different from our traditional Xiaomi white uh, smart home products, which we've been doing reviews over the past videos. Today we'll be looking at the Toya fingerprint door lock. So this is the Toya's uh, fingerprint door lock and I have it mounted on a wood, wooden uh, prototype, door prototype and so this is what it looks like. This is um, the back panel and this is the front panel. This comes with a key card, a mechanical um, key which you can use. You can also open this door with a fingerprint or with a code. So you can use this to unlock. And at the back, it has a battery pack. So you, you load this with AAA batteries and it runs on it. So in case uh, your battery dies down when you're out of the house, uh, you can use the mechanical key to open but it also has uh, Android uh, port so you can connect this to a power bank and it powers this device and you open it in case um, the battery dies when you're outside because the, the battery pack is inside and not outside so if you're out of your home and the batteries die down you have to open it either with the mechanical key or you use any uh, power source and keep and use the android cable to power this device on the front panel has a numeric part so you can input um, your passcode so you can do that and it also has the fingerprint sensor which is located on this handle It has a speaker unit right down here so you can hear the, what actions uh, are, are taking place. You can choose to use a single um, uh, access method such as the fingerprint but you can choose to use multiple. For example, someone can pick up on your uh, combination code but you can have multiple. That means you use uh, the fingerprint plus the code to open so just the code will not be able to open the door lock or you, you use the fingerprint and the mechanical key if you use that combination and someone uses the mechanical key they won't be able to open unless they have the combination there is also a remote um, function to this uh, uh, door lock this device you can connect to a Wi-Fi uh, source so you can remotely control it. For example, you can generate a temporary code for your door lock. If you have someone who wants to have access to your home but you don't want them to constantly have access, you can generate uh, a temporary code even remotely, even if you're not around them, sent by SMS or through WhatsApp, they would use that code to open. But this code can only last five minutes. After five minutes, this code uh, is no longer functional. It would reject, uh, the door lock will reject that code after five minutes. I'm sure you learned something from the video today. So do your boy a small favor. Click, comment, and subscribe. 
don't forget to click on the notification bell so they have instant updates every time we have a new video here is the link of my previous video and the link of my subscription button so you can click to subscribe if you're not yet subscribed we'll be doing another device next week it's another sunday another review for another device so i'll see you next week stay tuned